Guys, we've just came for some breakfast. We got a croissant each. Looks lush, can't we have that? And a little latte as well. We literally just stopped off somewhere like around the corner from the Louvre. Um, and we're gonna go and see the Mona Lisa sometime today. And uh, Emily wants to drop by Sephora. And you wanna go to Stranger Things. And I wanna go by the Stranger Things shop. I know I wanna buy something from there, but I don't know what I wanna get. Cause there was this t-shirt, so I don't know if I showed them like the, the vlog the other day, but I might end up getting that. And I need to buy a little present for my niece. Cause that birthday's coming up and Christmas coming up. So if I can get that, that'll be me happy. But yeah, we're walking over to the Louvre now, and um, I can't actually see if I'm filming me or not. Is that someone's wedding? Like, do you think they're doing a photo shoot? Oh. Wedding! Wanna go to Starbucks? Oh. Or a one. A nice one. I'll buy it, come on. Yeah, they're fair, they don't have any. Pretty embarrassing, that. But to be fair though, it is like midday. Everyone would have had them by now. Guys, we just came down and I think we should have pre-booked. Um, so we've decided, well, because look at this. So we've decided we're going to, um, we're going to pre-book and come tomorrow morning before we leave. Because that line is, honestly, it goes all the way back. It's huge. So I think it's best that we just come back in the morning. But look at this. That is beautiful. You can see the Eiffel Tower, whatever that is, that's mint. Yeah, yeah, I'll get you four, two cents. Guys, if you're watching French news, you might see one because obviously we're famous now. We go to the Yeah, we are. We just went in Zara and it was like, mad. Like really, really nice, but clothes were all like granny clothes, so left. When we came out with Zara, there was this like beggar on the floor and he had a little like, like cut open bottle with coins in and he, as I was walking I was avoiding it and he pushed it in front of us and knocked it all over so I thought for a second like oh I'm gonna like pick it up I was like nah you just did that on purpose so I'm not helping you but like if anyone's been in France before does that happen often because that was so weird like earlier I've almost seen someone knock one over I think and it, it must be what happened but Yeah, just found, we just wandered in by accident, but we just found the shopping uh, center from Emily in Paris. Look at the roof. Like, maybe this stuff yeah. is insane. We've been walking around here and we're Googling like what it is, what it's called and stuff, not realizing we're actually in it. That's, I wonder what entrance to come in then, because they run up like a wall, don't they? One eternity later. Would you just look at that view? Alright, well, we've decided that we're gonna go into Sephora, do the Stranger Things shop again, and then head back to the hotel. But on the way to the hotel, oh, it's here, run PS5. On the way to the hotel, we're gonna um, try to find a little cafe, you get some lunch, and uh, a hot chocolate. Because we've not had one of the famous hot chocolates yet, and we really want one. And then yeah, I think maybe we should, maybe when we're at the hotel, book the uh, loop for tomorrow. Yeah. Guys, I convinced them to come back. I love this shop. Hopefully this time I'm going to buy something. Um, not sure what I'm going to get. But I definitely want to buy something. Ranger things. You guys have already seen all this. <laughs> guys, we're actually starving, so we stopped off at the McDonald's to get some food. We've ordered a baguette and it's called a New York Wrap. I'll let you know what I think of it. But if you want to see my reactions to it, make sure you follow us on TikTok because that is where I'm going to be reviewing it. Guys, we are at the bench where Emily in Paris first met Mindy. Well, kind of, we're at one of them. It's actually further along that way, we believe. But we're at one of them. Look at how nice this area is. Oh, I actually love it, yeah. It's really peaceful. There's a massive fountain over there. And um, I think we're going to try and get some photos on the camera over there and then get them printed off. 
when we're back home. Also, just to add, we did not realize that this is right across the road from the Louvre. So we came to the Louvre earlier on because we were going to like try and just walk in, but didn't realize how busy it would be. Um, pretty stupid of though, because I knew that like 10 billion people go each year. But um, yeah, it's literally across the road. So we could have just came here instead of going all the way to the Ark to then come back here. Like, yeah, could save so much time. Guys, we just came into this um, kilo shop called Kilo Kilowatt or something like that. It's kind of a vibe. I like it. It does smell like, I'm not gonna lie. It really, it's got that pro like, terrible smell. What was it? Nice. Yeah, I'll show you guys these. I like these. He looks like he's had a better deal. <laughs> Seen him. Happy man. Guys, this is the biggest shop, like vintage shop I've ever seen. Wow, that was loud. But like, look, all the way down there, and all the way down there, it's absolutely massive. And there's a bit behind here. It's insane. That was a really cool like experience. We didn't find anything that we actually liked, but it, go at this shop if you're ever in Paris, because they've got some really cool stuff, and it's right close to the Louvre. Um, I really like in that the vibe was sick. It had some really good music on, some really good clothes, just nothing that was really my style or Emily's style. Guys, we just carried on walking and there. Uh, I'm trying to find a pull and bear, but we came across. It's not there, that's orange. I thought it was size. Uh, there is a size there is a size in here somewhere. Uh, we're gonna have a look inside. Is it Westfield? Oh this is to Westfield. Down there then. So I think, I think it, uh, it'll be other entrances if not. Yeah. Guys, it's all right. We found it. I don't know where we found this, but this place is huge. It's not too far away from the uh, the Louvre. This. Have to, to get to it. Yeah. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Escalators over there. Guys, I don't know if you're allowed to like film in here. But it's really hit me. Um. But look at all the like. It's got so much light for it. And then this, that's a mirror. I've just shipped myself and they felt, I thought I was going to fall down. That's pretty cool. This shop's huge though, look at it. Massive. I like the Nevada Twitty. Yeah, I like that. Nice though. I feel like I'm going to end up buying something. When in Rome. Guys, I've never seen anything like these self-checkouts before, right? You don't scan anything, you put it all in there and it works it out. I don't know how it does that. Like, there's no cameras or anything. It literally just senses it, you don't scan it. And just, yeah, so good. We need these in the UK, these are so much better. Right, we've just came back to the hotel just to get a bit, like, washed. And then we're gonna go get some food. And probably go down to the Eiffel Tower. Okay, we're gonna have to look for your passport. <laughs> Never mind, we found a passport. <laughs> it was in a bag. Um, but yeah, we're gonna like just chill for maybe an hour, get washed, and then go and get some food. Guys, we're just talking about earlier on. One more. Um, <laughs> next to where Emily's bench is from Emily in Paris. <laughs> It was proper funny. There was this oh this phone feels like it's about full, so I'm going to make this quick. But this guy was walking around <laughs> with like a cat on his shoulders. He had a leash on, like a lead on the cat, and the cat was just sat around the shoulders. <laughs> And he was taking him on a walk around the whole thing. It actually was, though. Oh my God, it was uh, so, uh, he if I do have a video, so I'll insult it now. Insult, Ins <laughs> insult it? I'll insert it now. <laughs> Guys, we've just had a very posh meal. I just, obviously, it's for last night. We oh, thought we'd. Tough. Sorry. Obviously, it's the last night. We thought we'd treat ourselves to a nice meal. So. Mm -hmm. We went to a very rec highly recommended restaurant, uh, McDonald's. <laughs> we went all out. Yeah, it was honestly probably one of the best McDonald's ever. Now we've came to Le Eiffel Tower. It looks yellow on this. We literally went to McDonald's because I wanted to make a TikTok and it honestly was amazing. They have chocolate McFlurry. Like, 
You know how the normal McFlurry is like vanilla flavored or something? It's chocolate. That was really good. Got potato wedges. The lot. Go on my TikTok and you'll see it. Yeah, it's so good. But now we're gonna get comfy and watch it sparkle. Just got a crepe each. I'm just still eating hers. And now we're gonna plop ourselves down by the river somewhere over there and watch it sparkle for the last time. Guys, I'll never ever get sick of this. Excuse me. Oh my god. Wow. This is the first time we've probably seen it up close, like with the lights on. Yeah, we've seen it from a distance. It's actually so pretty. Just take it in one last time. It's incredible. I know. Everyone was in the middle of the road trying to get that famous shot that day. Uh, like, you know, when someone stands in the middle of the road and they get that picture, look where all the cars coming around and the arcs at the end. There was like an actual queue in the middle of the road. Yeah, dead quick, like push it away in. Like, because I was, I was thinking about trying it and, I, and Emily goes, Ryan, there's a queue. Like, it was huge. Right, we thought we'd just add a little bit onto the vlog, a bit of like answering questions with my girlfriend. Um, so we're at McDonald's in a minute. We got a first bolt. I have no idea how you spell it. That burger is unbelievable. It's the sauce. I ordered, yeah, the sauce and that's unreal. I ordered um, a big tasty, chicken big tasty. I've got a normal big tasty, but I'll, <coughs> I'll have it anyways. Chalking. <coughs> got some wedges. These, why are these not in the UK? These are the best. Are you alright? No, I'm proper chogan. I am more my one. The best things you can get in my farm. I got Fanta as well. And if you know Fanta and any other country other than UK, it is amazing. And one thing we don't have in the UK, which we've got here, chocolate ice McFlurry ice cream. Right? And for toppings, peanut MMs. Mm -hmm. Right. What questions we've got? Um, Oh, can you? Um, got the one. When slash where did we meet? Um. <laughs> I think that's quite a hard one to answer for us. Technically, I met her at our work because I, I fancied I found out where she worked and I went in. Not in a stalker <laughs> room, yeah. Not in a stalker room. We were messaging, but not like that. Yeah, yeah we were like just talking to make friends. Sort of getting a vibe for each other. And um And then she's never got rid of us since. <laughs> Probably sick of us. Yeah. Well I knew of you when you followed us. Apparently I followed her. But then you can't remember. <laughs> so where was our first date? This is another tricky one yeah. because would you count that as the first date? The first time we met up we went to the beach. And had like yeah. a walk along the beach. But I wasn't the day. But it was because basically I didn't want to go on like a full frontal date where you're like at a restaurant sit down. I don't know. I just get. I think I would be too nervous and get a bit anxious. So and in my head, I thought like because I live next to the beach, like a walk along the beach just to get to know them. Yeah, and that's not really my kind. And of then go into like a full proper date you know? like a meal and stuff's not really my kind of date like i'd just be too nervous to be fair that was the first proper day i've ever been on proper date we had was in january and we went to um i booked a room in a hotel I booked a room in a hotel, um, Jury's Inn. We went to the dog cafe called Dog and Scone. If, you, if you're from Newcastle, you're visiting. Highly recommend, it's so cute. There's loads of little like puppies running around. Um, I'll insert some photos here if I can find any. And then afterwards, we went to Junkyard Golf, uh -huh. was it? Or Ghetto Golf? I can't remember which one Junkyard it was. Golf. Junkyard Golf. Junkyard. I get them to mix up. When in Junkyard Golf, I was winning. Emily cheated. You it did cheat. It's just a joke. Oh she, my god. She picked up the ball and cheated. So I was human because I'm very competitive. I didn't even know there was a lift there. I know they did the dad. Um, this is so good. What is this? 
It's spelled, it's called first and then the second word's B O E U F. When is my birthday? <laughs> May 10th. Nice. When, Mom? I was going to say February the 8th. Aye, uh, she knows. <laughs> well um, done. Where's my beef, Marshall? Can someone introduce this to the UK as well? I'm sitting in front of the TV. What's on the screen? You, probably the Kardashians or YouTube. Mm. You like watching vlogs? I love watching YouTube. What about me? Um, probably it's like a Sidemen video. The fellow podcast man. or something. I, I listen to that in the car, but yeah, um, I'll give you it. Cobra Kai. Love Cobra Kai. Or like a Disney movie. Or like something on Disney Plus. Yeah, I love films. Yeah, we had we went at um, Disneyland yesterday. Amazing, by the way. Like, I had the best. Yeah. It went so quick. We were there from like, so we got up at half six. Uh -huh. Got up at half six. We got a metro and a train to Disney. We were there for nine o'clock, it opens at 9.30. We were there from 9.30, well nine o'clock, till... What time did we probably leave? I it was after it closed. Ten, we got to this, uh, yeah, it Disney. took ages to get out of the park. What is the first thing that I do in the morning? You. I don't feel my lows here. Yeah. I normally just like try to fall back asleep. You lie there, whereas you get up like to lie like. there for a little bit. But I'm one of the people who gets up and having coffee. Yeah, you normally get up, I hate go to the bathroom, make a coffee maybe, and then come back into bed. Yeah. If I'm having a day off, you made the my most line work. is like 8am. Yeah, you, you are an early riser. I'm not. Mm -hmm. But I do have to get up naturally, like, like early for work. Mm -hmm. Right. When we came on holiday, we were, what time did we get up? Like 2? Two. 2? Two. I think two, wasn't it, or half two? When? When we came here. The morning we flew. Oh, right, two in the morning, yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, like, I'd say it, I struggled really bad there. But I did all right because I had to drive. And we called McDonald's and got a coffee, which helped. That helped. Um, but, like, yesterday, mor <coughs> yesterday morning's the earliest I've been. I think we were, like, excited. I've been ages. Oh, yeah. Because we were, like, Disney and stuff. Yes, yeah, I was just so like, I just ran off as well and then like... No, it's not. What? It's 9 o'clock. Probably. How? This day has gone really quick. How is it 9 o'clock? I'm not surprised. We left at half seven. If you could be any animal, what would you be and why? Yeah. Classic question. Okay, I've got a better one actually. Who usually wins our arguments? Me. Yeah, because I give up. Even though I know I'm right. Oh, guys, when we were with them... Just trying to get a photo and the guy was in the background. When we were walking around earlier, um, we came by us. Like, so basically, I don't know if I said, we went at the loo the day, didn't realise mm. the loo. When did the loo We went at the loo, I <laughs> had a wee. Um, when the loo the day, and didn't realise how Long hectic it was. it was. Like, the, the queue was massive. I'm sure they know what it's more than Lisa. Yeah. So we decided we're going to book it tonight, which we should probably do like in a minute, yeah. and then go um, tomorrow morning. Like we left there, went on to what was that shopping place called? Hmm? Went the shopping place next to you. Oh, the Champs de la I could be saying that totally. Yeah, right. went there, and then we went to go to the park where Emily in Paris is filmed. Do you know oh the one? My God. The one where the, the go back there, Ricky. where Emily and Mindy meet. Just to sit and have but a we didn't, Yeah, it was unreal, like honestly, amazing park. Like so like peaceful, like we said, well, that's the most relaxed we've felt like in this entire holiday. As we got there, we realized that it's right next to the, the, the Louvre. So we so we could have just went in the morning, the left. I don't know what the thought process was to then go but I, it, on the to map the arc, to then go come back all the way to the Louvre. On the map, it looked closer okay. to the Eiffel Tower. Your oh, map just fucked up. Yeah, my ma maps was like, behind me. It's been tabled the wrong place, like the opposite directions to what we wanted to go in. Yesterday, right? When we were leaving Disney. Do you remember, as we were leaving Disney, we went in the gift shop, this girl's hair got caught in the zip oh my God. here, and her dad was like, well, I'm guessing it's her dad, mm. just stood there looking at us, 
like a piece of shit and I'm like well it's not my fault I didn't do it on purpose I hate it's like went against it got tagged or he helped eventually after like five minutes and then we went into the Christmas bit because Emily wanted to look at the baubles and then when we, were th when we were there I just literally held one I felt like cracking my hands so I dropped it because it hurt <gasps> shattered everywhere and then and then today one past this homeless guy Oh wait, I think he was beggar at least. He had a little like, like a like a water bottle, but it was cut, coins in it. <laughs> and he had it on the floor, and I watched him. He pushed it in front of his, and obviously I knocked it because he did it when I was close. Went everywhere, and I looked, and I was thinking in my head, "Am I gonna help him?" No, because I just carried on walking. <laughs> Why did he do that? Like, I'm not gonna help you. If you you did that on purpose. You know what I mean? But yeah, I need to try these for a video, McFlurry from a TikTok. Um. So if, if you haven't already, make sure you already follow. Mostly probably are. Make sure you're following us on TikTok. We're gonna finish the McFlurries. And if you wanna see Emily in more videos, you wanna see more sit-down oh, videos like this with Emily, so nice. let us know in the comments. Um yeah, peace.